Good morning, everybody, and this is your S and P 500 day trade setup for today. So, um, first things first. Uh, that was just the internet going down. So, first things first. Uh, we did get back down to this area of 39.39, and uh, hopefully, you guys got in on that action. We had a an attempt early in the day and then we had a second attempt which was another entry pretty much uh, gave you a 200 odd point uh, well 300 point um, opportunity so that's that i think that uh, move has been played out uh, what we now need to do is look for the next opportunity and the next opportunity as far as i'm concerned is this massive cup and handle that has formed so here we have the cup here we have the handle um, grouping the oscillators is not really in uh, oversold territory or overbought territory at the moment, but it is getting there. So just bear that in the back of your mind. Um, if we look at the three hour, we're definitely in overbought territory at the moment, but um, also a bit of an inverse head and shoulders here. So there's the shoulder, he has a big head, and he has another shoulder here. So basically, it's just a consolidation. I suspect we are looking. We've already tagged that inside bar. You can see that being tagged. Um, all that's left to tag now is pretty much the all-time high. And I think they sort of put it in. So that's the one that will be tagged, and you'll get some selling off there. So let's just get the hour, and uh, so we understand what is transpiring here. So what the the bulls are trying to do is break through all-time highs. Okay, and what the bears are trying to do is they're trying to form a double top here. So there's a lot of uh, push and pull at the moment. I just want to check if there's no diversions or anything. Just give me a sec. I didn't look at that. Uh, not well. There is some diversions brewing here. As you can see, there's a high, higher high, high low. So there is a bit of diversions brewing here at the moment. But uh, I strongly suspect this is just sideways. Now, the longer it goes sideways with a massive target above us, like 4,000, uh, the higher the probability is of us is going through that target. Now, that target is basically just based on a previous consolidation measured move uh, early or well, late last year. And um, that's what we're looking for. So for me at the moment, it was sideways most of the day. And then we had the move to the upside. And then you can see the seller stepping in up here. So areas to watch today are pretty much 39.65, uh, 39.61. I don't think we'll come back down to 39.39. I think that's been successfully defended twice here. You can see there was a first time, there's a second time. So I think that um, is done. Weekly gap has closed as well. So for me at the moment, sideways, we're looking for a break. Now, again, 15 minute is the way to go. And you can see here pretty much fairly soon after I got the videos out yesterday um, half past seven so basically just as the videos were published you had the first signal there it is there and it rallied up came back there was another signal there uh, and there was another one there and that fell just short of the target and then you had this happening during the uh, trading session group to the downside off a level and the level that it was coming off here wasn't quite 39.39 but this little climb at the on the left here so you can see how perfect that was so what you're looking for is a similar setup now for me I'm just going to I just want to get that up there so that's the zone I'm looking for at the moment. That is 39.65 and 39.62. Looking for price to come into that area for another attempt at this high, which is 39.82. Then we're looking for 39.90, and then we're looking for 4,000. So I'm still looking to buy, not looking to buy at the moment. If you look at the oscillators, uh, wait for European Open, see what transpires. Been pretty flat yesterday but um, any dip is worth buying at the moment. If we start dropping below the lows of Friday, then we have a problem. So that's sort of your stop area at the moment. Okay, oh, sorry, not Friday of uh, Monday. Friday's lows down here. Okay, well, that's it for me. Hope it helps, and uh, we'll catch up with you tomorrow morning. Cheers for now.